Hey guys, Mr. Wahidul Hakia back with another video. Today I'm going to be unboxing and reviewing the David Beckham Respect. This is the Erda Toilet, a 90ml version. It's uh, the only David Beckham I've not owned, I guess. Uh, it's been out for a bit, not that long, probably a few years. Uh, but yeah, I've never had this before. So I'm going to go ahead and try this out. Uh, it's got this cool effect on it, like they usually have on the David Beckham and the classics and stuff. But they usually have it on the bottle, not the box. That's pretty cool how they have it in the box. It's got the David Beckham logo there, with the hole cut out like normal, that's the design. Don't know what the design's supposed to be. But it's just there in it, so yeah. Edgy toilet, vaporizer 90ml, just a 90ml. The bottle actually seems quite small for the box, I mean. And the bottle, who knows. It's a bit squished, I don't know why. It's the box, so who cares? Made in Spain, distributed by Cotti like normal. Okay, so we'll go through the ingredients alcohol, denat, aqua, water, air perfume, fragrance, limonene, linonene, citral, blah, blah, blah. Okay, that's as much, much as I can say. Citral, geraniol, coumarin. These are all like uh, sweet smells, like uh, ingredients, I mean, citral and stuff like that. Geraniol is quite sweet as well. So this could be very interesting. Let's go ahead and open this and show you what the bottle looks like. So, oh shit. So the inside actually changes to some cool ass texture. That's nice guys. Look at that, it carries on everywhere. Very nice of that. Same, the whole inside's like that. That's, they should put this on the outside guys. Wow. That's cool effect guys, I like it. Very nice. They should have done that on the outside with the David Beckham logo in grey Something like that, silver That kind of silver I guess, or white uh, So this the bottle itself is a fingerprint magnet and it's very effective So my camera is having a hard time picking that up probably But yeah Got David Beckham sign here It's actually engraved as well Oh that's dirty as fuck I'm gonna give you a clean So it looks a bit better Let's have a see Okay that's not helping much Helping as much as I can, make it nice and shiny. Well, that's failing quite badly. That's as shiny as I can get, guys. Alright, guys. So this is David Beckham respect, as I've told you already. It's got this cool ass effect here. It's like a Wi-Fi effect. <laughs> you know the Wi-Fi logo. It's like that. If you can see it. But yeah, it's a pretty cool effect. It goes like that. It's a bit of dirt on here. That's annoying me. But yeah. The, it's engraved and stuff, I like it. Look how it's jagged. I like that. Pretty cool, I've not seen that on a bottle before. Especially off a David Beckham range. That should have been at the front, I guess. Okay, so we've got David Beckham there and some weird ass lid. The lid's actually very weird compared to everything else. This whole bottle is weird, but yeah. This is all jagged as well. Dirty as fork. Fingerprints, very dirty bottle. Just don't know if there was anything on the back, but that's dirty as well. Very dirty, 90 mil as you can see. And it's very, you gain some chrome colors from this, which is pretty cool. I'm gonna go ahead and take this off. Okay, so the top is actually, yeah, that's dirty as fuck. I'm gonna give this a clean eventually. It's brand new, so I don't get why it's so dirty. Probably when the people are putting it in. But yeah. Okay, so that's the top lid, it's black and that's chrome. Let's go ahead and spray this. Ooh! That is quite powerful. It's powerful, but it's not overpowering. So that's really good, I like it. It's a very fresh smell and very sweet, fresh, clean smell. I definitely recommend this smell. I can smell some sort of lavender or something. Oh, there's definitely patchouli in there. I can smell that. Hmm. Not sure. I'm smelling a bit of grapefruit too, but that's probably not right because I've never had grapefruit in a spray before from David Beckham. They tend to use the same similar notes in most of them. So I'd be surprised if they have grapefruit in this. We shall find out anyway. So yeah. Very nice smell guys. This is like a daytime use uh, perfume though. 
so yeah it's good for the daytime and i'd say it's good for summer to be honest which is perfect for now and uh, it's very it's very powerful powerful smell it's not overpowering so it won't it won't fill up a room it won't fill up a room but it will definitely make it stand out you'll be able to smell it from when someone walks past you you'll be able to smell it you don't have to be right up close to them and stuff like that so yeah it's a very nice smell it's a very sweet smell i'm gonna go ahead and tell you the notes now ah oh, this bottle's so dirty guys i got the ocd okay guys the top notes are grapefruit watermelon and pink pepper i actually got the grapefruit what the hell they actually use grapefruit in this guys i'm very surprised hard notes are cardamom Lavendin and basil Lavendin hmm. uh, Dry down which is the bottom notes Vet Vetiver patchouli that's I smell the vet patchouli straight away My nose must be very good at smelling patchouli or something and there's moss in it as well. So yeah I highly recommend this spray very nice one of the one of the good ones of the David Beckham series David Beckham series actually is pretty good itself anyway, but yeah, this probably the best one of the David Beckham series so far is probably David Beckham Classic. Then it's the David Beckham Beyond. Then it's David Beckham Blue, Classic Blue. Then it's this. So this is fourth in the list, I guess. And then it's the Instinct, in my opinion. They're my top five. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you're new. I'm going to clean this bottle eventually. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Check out my other fragrance unboxings and... Let me know if you want me to unbox anything.